Sorry I didn't get to put out a video earlier in the week. I, last week I was actually uh, a little bit under the weather, so I did take the time to get organized so I can have a better consistent works video schedule for you guys so I can make sure I can put these out more consistently. And thank you for joining me today where I have another paranormal media where I found a video from YouTube of a UFO sighting from earlier in the year from the Alan Barrera channel. Don't forget I have that Instagram page where I do a cryptid of the day so if you're interested in seeing more creepy things there is a link in the description for that. Please share the video to help out the channel the most and subscribe with the bell icon turned on and without further ado let's get into the Alan Barrera UFO sighting. <laughs> Yeah. Alan, why is it? I don't know what it is. It looks like a damn UFO. <laughs> why, is it, why is it supposed to? Wh where is it going? Now, after watching the video, you can see that you might be mistaken for taking it at face value and seeing that this is actually just, you know, a uh, UFO sighting on YouTube. Now, I did say that there was only one video, but as I, going back to write the script, I did, you know, was looking at the video, kind of gathering what I would put down on paper, and a second video kind of popped up from that same channel. And we'll go over both the videos in full, but we want to go over this one a little bit further. And looking at it, it was posted over three months months ago in July and the name of the video is the real UFO Whitwell Tennessee. The runtime for the video is about 23 seconds long and as you're seeing on your screen again it's just a video of kind of a white dot uh, you know it kind of looks like it's slowly descending over the mountaintop out in the distance and you know I can see that this might be something more UFO related but honestly I'm just not convinced that this is a UFO in the sense of an alien or anything you know it's weird and reading some of the comments and looking over some of the reddit posts it would seem that most people think that this is just a plane that's so far off you just can't see the wings and you know looking at it it does kind of go down like a plane it doesn't really zoom off in the distance like any ufo or a big ufo sighting or anything along those lines so it is something that i would have to say here on this first video that it is more of a just kind of a plane slowly descending over the mountains because as you see it it doesn't like i said it doesn't zoom off it's kind of slowly descends here over the mountain and down and then it's gone. So I would say that that's most likely just a plane if you had if I had to guess. I'm trying to see if I can get this. So this is just hovering above the cloud. Now, taking a look at the second video, it is a bit longer as you saw at about 49 seconds long and it seemed to have a white dot sitting over a giant cloud with lightning going off inside of it. And it would seem that, you know, it might be taken from the same location, but at least the same round uh, area. I'm not totally in sure because it didn't say in the description of the video. And don't get me wrong. When you first look at the video, it does seem like there is something weird going on. And I don't know if it's necessarily, again, a weird UFO thing, or but nevertheless, it is pretty weird. And if you're looking at the video uh, for the full 49 second runtime, though, and from the point of the cameraman, you can actually see that this is most likely another plane, as it does slightly move in a downward uh, type of position. So it just kind of seems like this is more of a perspective type thing, where you see a plane that looks like it's more floating above you, because it's coming straight at you and it's such a far distance that it does kind of seem like the plane is sitting there floating. But we ha do have to keep in mind that planes do usually fly about 31,000 to 38,000 feet above us at about 5.9 to 7.2 miles above 
above, which is extremely high. It's very hard for an eye to make out the finer details on a passing plane that is over seven miles above you. And I'm not going to sit here and say that the creator of the video is trying to pull one over on us or anything along those lines, but I can honestly see how someone might mistake these white dots as UFOs, but taking a second look and using a bit of common sense, it doesn't seem to add up as a big UFO conspiracy or a bunch of UFOs flying around in Tennessee. But it's more likely that someone is looking for something where there isn't anything, and if you go looking for something and you want it to find it, then well, you know, you're going to find that thing. And I'm not saying that the person is going around looking for UFOs as there's only two videos on the whole channel and they're being months apart. But what I am saying is that the, the person believes then flying UFOs are, and that they're around his city, the person is going to make a few videos and will always find UFOs and will be making a biased opinion to what he's looking at on the video rather than taking it for some face value that he does live in Tennessee, there's probably a lot of planes flying around and they're a lot higher than most people might think. Well, that's the video for this evening. I do hope that you guys did enjoy the video, and if you did, please hit the like button to let me know that you did. Please also check out the other channel as there is a link in the description, but please be respectful as harassment is just stupid. Also, don't forget to check out the Instagram where I have the cryptid of the day and other creepy things that I find from around the web. Please share the video to help out the channel the most. Subscribe with the bell icon turned on for more content like this, and good night. Sleep tight, don't let all the bed bugs bite.